Import error. Attempted relative import with no known parent package. How do we fix this error? That's to this video. Let's dive into it. We'll start with this toy project structure. If we open git bash in the root folder where our package is located, we can type tree to see how the directory is structured. The root contains the package. We, we know that this is a package because it has um, an init inside it. And inside the package, you have this module A. You also have this sub package, which also has an init.py. This tells Python that it is also part of this package. Let's look at relative imports first. Let's say in submodule A, we want to use the functions for module A. If we open up submodule, so here we can see that we are using double dot to import module A. We are inside submodule A. So in order to import module A, we need to go back one folder and then we can import it. So to go back, we use the double dot. And then import star just means import everything. Here, the func A, this is a function inside module A. So this will work if we run this module from the root directory. So let's try this. If I So right now, we can see that we are in the directory where the package is. So if I run Python minus M, meaning running it as a module type package dot sub package one dot sub module A. Oh, we can see everything is running without any errors. Good. So we can also do absolute imports. Let's say in module A this time, we want to use functions from sub module A. An absolute import means we start with the package name, the folder which we want to import from, and then the module which we want to import. And again, import star means we're importing all the functions. Sub func A function in the sub module will get run as well. So again, to run this module directly from the terminal, we need to make sure that we are running from the folder where the package is located, okay? Not inside the package. Make sure we are in the folder where the package is, and then we go Python dash M again running as a module and then package dot uh, module A. And again, everything works. If you want to run it interactively, for example, in Spider, then you need to pip install your package in an editable state and then use absolute imports. So you need to have a setup file. You import setup and find packages from the setup tools library. And then you just simply do something like this. All you do is pip install dash e dot. That's going to find all the packages here and install it. So now you should be able to go into Spider. So here you can see I've opened up submodule A. The second line here is the absolute import. We can see we are calling the, the package name and the module which we want to import. And if we run it directly, it should be no problem. You should be able to find it because we have installed the package onto our computer. If we did not have this absolute import and just have the relative import, we will get an error. Attempted relative import with no known parent package. Python can't see where the package is when we are inside the package. So in order to use relative imports, we must run the module outside of the package. If you want to run the module inside, you will need to use absolute imports and have package installed. Okay, I hope that helps and clarifies uh, the difference between relative imports and absolute imports. If you found the video helpful, let me know in the comments below.